As I stay, stay, when the right thing keeps on. What's up, everybody? Um, this song, it's just, it just hit me really hard, and I was like, I want to share this song. Uh, it's not on YouTube. Um, this is the original uh, arrangement of Who Can I Run To, uh, recorded by a legend in her own time. Uh, a li well, a living legend, she's still alive, and we really appreciate her contributions to gospel music. And her name is none other than Evangelist Rita Thomas. Um, this, this song, she um, actually put her own little, she revised the lyrics and put her own uh, f uh, spin to it. And it's a remarkable, remarkable rendition. And I want you all to listen to it with me. It's entitled, Who Can I Run To? This is none other than Evangelist Rita Thomas and her choir, well, her group, his. And I also featured her in uh, volume seven of my magazine. Uh, so hopefully this touched your heart. And what's up, Richard? I love you so much, man. Thank you so much for all you do. Let's take a listen. This is her talking at the beginning. Thank you, Dwayne Lightsey, for sending this to me. And uh, I'm in the process of uploading a snippet of the interview that I did with her. And she talks about singing with the Father Hayes Specials. Uh, in Chicago, um, Father Hayes Specials was a group that uh, Father Hayes uh, used uh, in his church in the early uh, in the early days of the formation of uh, Universal Kingdom of Christ. But this is Evangelist Rita Thomas. She stood up in the back, and before coming down to give the minister her hand, she asked if she could have a word to say. That young lady stood there that morning with tears in her eyes. She stood with a broken heart. She stood and she was crying and she wanted to talk to the church. And I believe this was her testimony. As I stand here contemplating this is her right here. on the right thing to decide, will I take the wrong direction? Oh, my love. That's a beautiful one. I love her so, so much. And I'm not afraid of change. I have yet to find that someone who would care to satisfy me, to stand by me. Woody, love you, man. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you really so much. Listen, why, um, while this track is playing, one thing that is so moving to me about gospel music is that the connotations of gospel music, we can find a way to make the message relevant and contemporary in our own lives, away from the primary message of the song. And a song like this, no matter what it is that it is that you may be facing in life, the message and the connotations is Jesus. You can run to Jesus, no matter what it is. I mean, if it's the broken heart, if it's financial issues, 
family issues, whatever the situation is, you can run to Jesus, to the higher power, to who you trust, to who you have your faith in. You can run to him. It's a beautiful message. And right before, I, I wasn't intending to say this, but I think this is a great place uh, to say this. Uh, earlier today, this morning, I was invited to brunch. And we went to this restaurant and I ordered just, just about everything that I can find on the menu. And uh, I'm just sitting there, we're just eating our food, you know, and all of a sudden, uh, our waiter, she's pouring my water and she said, oh, and by the way, this table has taken care of your bill. And I'm looking like, huh? I'm like, you, you, what? Like, I'm just like, what are you, what are you talking about? And then I looked over, no one was sitting there anymore. I mean, I, I, I mean, I tried to gain composure because I was very emotional. Um, didn't, stranger, didn't even know him, you know, uh, I went outside trying to look for him to just really embrace him and tell him thank you so much, you know, and he wasn't there, and when I came back to the table, you know, and it, it just hit me so hard that, you know, God will send you signs, you know, just in the nick of time to encourage you, and he will give, he will use someone to bless you. You know, no matter what, I, it could be financial, it could be a financial blessing, it could be whatever. You know, that gift, you know, is just a sign from the Lord to let you know that, man, you just got to keep holding on. And in lieu of this uh, message, I just want to tell you and each and every one of you that no matter what you're facing in life, you just keep holding on and run to Jesus. All right? I love you all and nothing you can do about it. Love on someone and change a life.